All right, let's do some unclear levels. From 2020, ideally, randomly generated, we choose this level. I think it's a new soup speedrun. Can't escape them. Yeah, there's a Supiron 60 seconds. It's got a bum bum. I'll try it. Oh, wait, we gotta go over the top. Wait, there's actually arrows up here. What does this mean? That's the biggest Z I've ever seen. Kind of. Is this another like multi route speedrun thing? Please tell me there's not one that just. It's like a death door. We're just gonna browse for a bit. What is this? Am I stuck, step bro? Can I, can I really not get out of this? Oh, no, we did it. How do you... I think you have to, like, land on the note block again and just run off. Okay, I definitely don't want to go this way. This is not the most fun way. Oh, you also just can't go back. All right. Dude, this one's impossible. Hey, what's over here? Besides the big Z? Let's go this way. Probably should do it from below. It's probably easier to. Dude, so much speed. Too much speed! Alright. Is it like a kind of a, a trollish lull? I imagine I do have to pick a correct way. But we'll uh, investigate without the program for now because I'm. Curious. No George. I could have reacted to that, maybe. Ah, oh, shoot. Well, what's over here? That's where the door was below. Uh, well, I'm gonna boo it. This might be the correct way for now. Hey, here's that bum bum we saw. Another fish. I'd expect nothing less. Oh my god, Bubba, that sauce. Oh, no, I forgot about the fish. Dude, Bubba is out gaming me in every way possible. That's where the X is. I wonder if I could have just jumped over it. Uh, I don't trust any of this. Okay. I kind of want to jump over it, actually. Yeah, that's like way better. I think I'm actually supposed to probably line this up. Like, do this. Oh, never mind. I thought I was going to do a triple jump setup. Let's go. I don't know. Let's go this way. To the door. Oh! Okay, hold on. That's a tough jump. I think it's the right way. I'll say this is a lot more interesting about first level than I thought it'd be. I thought it was gonna just be a regular 60 second speedrun. Let's try the pipe because I don't feel like seeing what's over there. The door. Oh, maybe I should have tried that door. This is so like just yeah, just like pick a path. Let's go this way. Uh, I could go over the top. Let's just try one of these doors. No. Well, how kind of you to let me go back? No again. Well, that door in the air right below there is probably also wrong. But I don't have any other options, right? Well, I guess I could take this door up all the way up top by the one ways, but... Let's just go back to the conveyor area instead. What a great level. Oh, time save. That's, that jumps me in. It's hard. That jump, man. I was about to say, if this is the wrong way, I'm still going to be upset. Nice coin block. My patience is almost out where I actually look to see where I'm going. Alright, if I die one more time, I'm just going to see where I'm going. Hmm. Sick. Alright, we're done with this. That was kind of terrible. I want to make sure we figure out where to be homies at. So let's check real quick. Oh, 0.52%, nice. That's super expert. Well, oh, apparently you can go up here too. It doesn't do anything. What happens if you keep going this way? Oh, <laughs> at least the most annoying way was wrong. 
Okay, so you do want to go this way. And then... I guess it doesn't matter which way you go here. It's just longer if you take the door. And then... Yeah, don't take this pipe, right? Any way to... Uh, get... What is this mess? Yeah, so everything was wrong. You somehow get over the top here. Yeah, you get dumped here. So subworld's incorrect. How do you even like get over to the swamp? Alright. I don't know. Well... Wait, what is this? Oh, this is the thumbnail shot. I was gonna say, you can't even get here, really. Alright, we have to be homie twice. Even bigger arrow. And then here's another arrow. Alright, new level. Refresh. What are the chances there's another Japanese new soup speedrun? The answer is... It's another, it's another Japanese new soup speedrun. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. There it is, man. Supiran da. Four. Fine, we'll do another one. Oh, we have a clear con. Don't take damage. Sure. There is a spike there. This one at least looks like one, so... The other one wasn't. So we'll play this one out, and then I'll probably skip any more Japanese C Soup Seerons we get. From the algorithm. From the website. One day we'll escape Japanese Yusu Sirens, maybe. Got a triple get height there. Yo, two lives, this is expert. I probably need you, don't I? Oh, I almost saved it. Okay, so you don't want to move in this part. That's basically it. No, airship theme, stop, where's the ground? Okay, I can run across. Yeet! Too far. Yeet! If Tyler yeeted it again, she would have a heck of an arm. Is this gonna be actually 30 seconds though? We'll find out. Nope. Alright, that's a quick one. We'll take it. From this on, this point on, we're not gonna do any more Japanese new soups, at least for today. We'll Hopefully the algorithm will give something else. Aha! Not a Jaffy Zoo Soup. But this one starts off with PP. Six tough tricks in a cave. The person with the worker is the best. It's about to be me, smile. This looks hard. Okay, what am I doing? So I'm gonna... Uh... Something's bouncing off the springboard. Which one is it? I have three things that could, that could bounce off that. Okay, well, for now, can I just do this to see what is going on? Probably need the springboard and then something else, maybe. How is this even supposed to work? Like, what does it want me to bounce off the springboard? What is the purpose of this bomb? So it looks like I throw something up as well. Probably the springboard. I think I throw the springboard up. And then I have to bounce either off the spa bomb or the pow. Mm, mm, what? I think I know what to do. Watch. I think I, I kind of understand. Never mind. That was terrible. I was going to see if I can grab the pow and drop it. Dude, this part is just... What is this part wanting me to do? I think I definitely am supposed to kick this springboard up here. I think. It's either that or the bomb, but why would I need the bomb on the right side? I could throw the, also the bomb up there. Wait, that's what I just said. See, there's an ice block next to the pow, which makes me want to believe that's what the bomb is for, but then what, what do I need the pow for? Alright. Let me just do this for now. Again, to see what we have to work with. Oh, there's a block here. I didn't see this block. So that's why we need the bomb. So that means that we do throw the bomb up. And then that's... I just need the bomb, right? So what we can do is we can kick the springboard so it lands here. Then as we do that, we throw the bomb up. We grab this pow, drop it here, then go here. That, may, that would probably be the most logical. Oh. 
Okay, I have a lot more time. I'm also up on. I mean, it works, but why is there a sideways springboard here? <laughs> that like threw me off because I thought I had to like hit it, but I don't need it. I think I don't need it. Aha, now what? I see this, but like, then what? Do I bounce off of here? Can I make this at all? No, I think I'm just supposed to bounce off of it. I mean, that'll work. I kind of want to do a back, sh a back throw instead, because that might be easier than using the sideways springboard. Like, I just want to do this. Okay, maybe that's not easier. I think I do have to throw it up. Dropping it does not give me enough time. Actually, let me do this. That might work. Hello Curbs. Is it? I don't know. This all is awful to sight read, I will say. Wow, I finally did that. Okay, now what? Um, what? I could kick the springboard and then kick the P-switch, and if it lands on top of each other, that's ideal. Okay, well you landed in... Actually, it might, that might work. I feel like this is what it wants me to do. I think, right? It's gonna land on that now. Wow, I need more sauce, but I was afraid it's gonna despawn. Okay, I wanna kick a little closer. You know, like this close? Yeah, it's close enough, I think. Hmm. Oh, I need to see, kind of see it. <laughs> I should probably set a visual cue, shouldn't I? I'm doing calculations in my head right now. I wanna go right before it reaches the apex, after doing a mental math watch, ready? Just kidding, I was an unice block. Actually, I want to go a little after the peak, I think. Dude, I need way more sauce, though. This is an easier version of Carl's? I'm curious now. I didn't know Carl made a level. Or I mean, like, wait, is this from, like, Mario Maker 1 level or 2? I played it as a... Which one did I play? I played a few of Carl's levels, but not this one for sure, if it's base, if it's an easier version of a Carl level. Probably why it's not so sight read friendly at all. Also, they might have just plagiarized this level. They didn't reference Carl's level at all. It feels like they just kind of tried to play it off as their own level, right? Now it's from Armaker 1. I don't know if there's a block, like, right in the middle of that saw, the far left one. I guess we'll eat and find out. That's farther than I wanted it to be. Well, that's a problem. I don't think I can respawn these. Let's watch this together, because it actually, I think it is similar. We'll watch without audio because, I don't know, I don't want to put on audio. Rip Mario Maker 1. <laughs> oh yeah, this is literally just the beginning, but easier. This is, this is literally his level. Do you guys see the resemblance already? <laughs> So I guess that is right. It wants, oh, if I do it in one motion. Okay, I don't really care about this part. So if I do it in one motion, it should line up. Oh, cool. Anyways, this is literally Carl's level. They plagiarized it because they're trying to play it off as their own. Uh, I should probably do this. I'm Carl, guys. Type the full length. Maybe this is Carl's alt. Yeah, Bailey. Is That's Carl. All right, now, now I understand, like... Well, not really. I still, I, that part was too fast for me to understand what I actually had to do. But something did bounce off the springboard. Maybe I'll watch the whole video after I play this. Dude, I'm about to just do the back shot because I can't do this. Pause back shot. Ayo. What did this, this guy say? Yeah, we're doing that. that I can see. That's way easier. Okay, so ideally I want to do it in one motion, right? I guess I'll just try once and adjust. Okay, that P went flying. I think I kick it and then jump. 
Okay, it has, that, does, that does have to line up though. I have to figure out exactly when and where and how much speed to throw each item for it to line up, which kind of sucks. I pushed Z, didn't work. Then, uh, so that thumb goes downwards and there's a wall. So I guess it does follow the level, right? Because I think there was a pipe immediately after. And I kind of want to see how much is after that. How much it like copies Carl's level before it just ends. Actually, let me do that. Just want to see what we have to work with. 43 seconds, huh? I'm kind of curious if this ending also copies Carl's level, like exactly. Is there a heart at the end of Carl's level? <laughs> yeah, so there's a pipe here and then there's not actually that much more. And then... Is that literally the end? Okay, I see. We'll watch the clear video after this, because we can uh, see what the resemblance is once we beat it. <laughs> the hardest part is I seem to figure out, I might actually build a practice hole just so I can figure out the springboard P-switch. Because once I figure out where to throw each thing, it's free. But until then, I just have to guess and check. Yeah, I'm gonna do that real quick. No, I hit undo, god dang it. Dude, what if Mario Maker had a redo button? Mario Maker 3? I feel like a redo button wouldn't be the worst. I mean, there's a, you see there's a spot for one more icon on the right side. They could put a redo button. All right, so let's... I don't, I don't really want to run the entire time because the springboard is too close. So I might just like do this. And then we'll do like do this. Oh, that lined up kind of well. So I mean, we don't, we can take our time. So I'll kick it from here and then we'll just like over in here. That's the wrong button. If I do it in one motion, it'll be look like... No, full motion doesn't line up really. So I think it is better if I just take my time. Well, for some reason, I'm not getting my Z though. I would like to get a Z. Because I am hitting the P-switch now. Why is it not working? This has to be, like, frame perfect. Alright. I think I'm pushing it too late. But we have the queue now, so I guess that's cool. Alright, watch and learn. We go bop. Oh-ho! See? Now what do I do? It probably would help to watch the video. What am I doing there? You know what, if it will watch it now, you can see the resemblance. No audio though, this is an audio-less level. Oh, so you're supposed to kick the springboard. That's how it bounces off. So then this part, we don't care about, they, they completely got rid of all that. They made this part a little harder because it was spaced out weirdly. And now we're supposed to, uh, Eventually get a bomb, right? Oh, there's a bomb. So we juggle it until we break the block and then... Two pows. Oh, if I'm supposed to do that, that is tough. I wonder how it's going to do this part simplified. Oh, that's the ocean, yeah, the ocean we saw in the level viewer. Hmm, I wonder if we have to do something like this then. I think the level does end, right? So I stand still and then I have to do something at the right time. We'll see if the level at the end that makes us do that, but all right, that's that's basically Carl's level. <laughs> the end also had a heart. Wow, they really literally just copied Carl's level but made it easier for them to be probably. They probably c couldn't beat the level themselves, so they just made a version where they could finally do it. Alright, at least I'm gonna stand here until it works, but I grabbed the POW accidentally. Okay, well, I mean, I could pre-throw one, right? And then, I do have to actually do a POW drop, I think. Which is hard. Uh, I probably should have thrown the top one first, shouldn't I have? <laughs> probably easy to do power drop in the second one. Wait, this is an old level, hold on. Oh, power drops are free, you see that? I forgot in 2020. 
See, it sticks to the wall, so power drops are more free. I should probably just learn the rest of the slows, because it'd be more effective. I'll do it. Yeah, I'll do it now, actually. Actually, there's a thwomp up here that I can't see. That actually kind of changes things, I think. Actually, I'm going to do this for now. I'm just going to see what we have to do. Let's get rid of this guy, and then... Oh, this won't be here. Oh, if I'm practicing in new physics, the pal drops immediately. <laughs> so I actually have to, like, time this for now. But I did it. Oh, I think I do have to do it in one motion. So I'm supposed to drop this pal and grab this one. And then drop it here. But I wonder if there's any cheese. Like, what if I do this? See this platform? What if I never jump on it? And I do this. Oh. So if I can do this. Yeah, we got some. Alright, this is way easier. I said to time this. One, two, three, four, five. All right, I just gotta probably figure out when I want to jump on what would blink. One, two, three, four, five. Wait, no, I don't even need it then. I only need one power, right? So I don't even need the bob bomb. Yeah, I don't even need the bob bomb. I literally just do this. Well, don't 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 mess it up, but. Well, if I don't suck, we can do it. Yeah, I mean, that. alright, that's all we do. I built it pretty much how it was, so. Alright, so these are gonna spawn not the same time, so I have to, like, come from here. This is, like, kinda accurate, but, I mean, if I hold right, it should be fine. So I'll just, like, go from here, I guess. Spawn them all, and then... Actually, how do I approach this? Am I gonna get enough distance? Oh, I forgot the duck. Well, it is a good thing I, I'm practicing this one though, because that's that is that's tough. One, two, three, four, five. All right, I I, I know how to count to five. We can beat this level. One, two, three. Four. Okay, I think I want to fall right when it. Blinks on four. That's when we start falling. One, two, three, four, five. All right, we've done it. I'll leave the end of the level to be a surprise. Also, because I just don't want to rebuild it. So either we're going to beat it immediately or die, or we do nothing for like 20 seconds and jump. So let's find out. You know, first try. Just kidding. I pushed jump, man. I pushed it. Oh, what? It's funny because I've basically cheesed like half these sections. So that's kind of cool. That's, I guess, one of the nice things about making it easier. A lot more room for cheese. I'm also curious if the creator cheesed some of it himself. Although, let's say that one's not really cheese. It's just an alternate way to do it. Because I think the springboard drop is, or drop on the springboard, I'd, I think it's harder. Probably not if you just develop a video cube, I'm too lazy. I'm redoing it this way. Plus, we'll do it right now. See, look. Just kidding. Alright, we'll try to drop once. Okay, well... Whatever. <laughs> That's a pick-your-own-adventure way to do it. Okay, then we just hold right. Wait on Yoshman. One, two, three, four. Aha. Alright, we're gonna play the game of don't hold anything. That is way simpler. All you do is you just jump, like, once you get to the left. Incredible. Well, in terms of difficulty, that one significantly lower once I understood the that you could just cheese it.
If you can't cheese that pal parts, it's actually kind of tough. Although the new, the old physics makes it a little easier. And then getting the key for the spring button piece switch helps. Otherwise, it was kind of annoying. Well, it kind of sad that they uh, plagiarized Carl's level. And I guess tried to play it off as their own. There's literally, literally no reference to Carl whatsoever. But yeah, uh, we did it. Sure. Another way. 2020. Gone. Oh yeah, I think they got the world record. So cool. I guess what, what they say was a cool person. I think we're getting a troll level. Toru. Troll chorus. I think this is a forced troll chorus. I think. Well, it's not forest, it's a swamp, but... Aha, it is forest. Look at that. I guess I will not jump. I will jump, then move to the left. And now I will... Why am I thinking? Too much thinking. Oh, don't hit me! For all I know, this is not even the right way. I kind of want to go above this, because that brought up part looks a little sussy. Uh. Shoot. There's another one. What's here? I'm going to run across and totally not get in this clown car. Maybe I should have actually tried to go up there. We. Oh, okay, that works. We. Well, that's blocked off. What's over here? Does it say hi? That says hi in something else. What is over here? A door. No! I had a feeling one would be a spike block, but I didn't expect it. I guess we'll go that way. Actually, I need to not hit all of them. So I need to keep one alive. This one. So I think I would have lost anyways. Oh, there's a goal. Okay, apparently the top also, you get the checkpoint, then you die, and then you get the orb? Well, we did it. Kind of curious what was in the pipe. It looks like we kind of just either the pipe error was completely useless and it would eventually kill me or we took a shortcut. The pipe did work. Wow. Chonky. We missed chonkiness. Okay. A pipe or door and then you go here and then do a bunch of stuff. I mean, it all seems like an actual level. The troll stuff. I guess you can go here. Can you go up top? Okay, apparently that's a dead end. Okay, you just run across, midway die, touch the top. What about the other way? This pipe? Hi! What does this say? What is that supposed to be? Is this a T? Oh, is this an... Oh, it says hint? Oh, it gives you a hint. Cool. Sure. I mean, I don't know where the end is. Probably met somewhere here, but we did it. I almost feel like this is just a dev route. You just go over the top and go far left, and then you just... We got one of them. I don't know. This is kind of a weird level. But whatever. We'll move on. One more. Fun fact, I had to skip through three Japanese new soups. To finally get not a Japanese new soup. Something block two. We got some blocks. Whoops. No spoilers. Even though the site kind of gives spoils you with some stuff. The description says there's a secret or there's a shortcut the other level. Oh. The stonks, where are they? Oh, I didn't realize that was happening. I think I can get those stonks. Haha. Uh -huh. That was the most calculating thing I've done. Except typing something into a calculator and pushing equals. Whoa! Big skewer, skewer guy. We're still alive. And I almost died. There's kind of some desert bus action going on. But at least it's blue. Danu. That first kanji means snake? Oh. Makes sense. There's a snake block here.
Yo, look at that Lido jump right there. Incredible. Uh, you're gonna go upwards. Okay. Cool, we did it. At least it's not really necessary to get the feller. It kind of helped a little. Didn't I see stuff out at the top out of the corner of my eye? No, don't do this. Don't you dare do this. Okay, I saw a glimpse of stuff up top. What is that? What was that I saw? No. We don't like to see this. You gave me a nut! Am I just out of here? Dude, I, why is there another door? Where's that other door? Man, you skip all that. Skip this, skip everything. But why is there a second door? Where's that one? I have to check again. Because there might be even a faster dev route. That still works. Hold on, we gotta, we gotta look again. Can't get into it, so there has to be exit. Oh. Okay. <laughs> That door exists. I'll still have to be homing for this part, though. You don't need a feller, at least. Because they gave you a nut. Man, you just skip everything. It's so tragic. This one gets the fattest of arrows. And then we will type in dev. You know, that was uh, not a bad E. And we make sure we can see it. See, look, appreciate our art. Look at our artwork. Alright, well, we knocked out four unclear levels from 2020. Hype. They were all kind of bad. Like, this one, the dev, this one was a weird troll. Apparently, the shortcut was... Well, to tell you it's a shortcut, that's cool, I guess. So he skipped a lot of the troll. We got a plagiarized level. Completely pl just made an easier version with more cheese of Carl's level from Armaker 1. Try to play it off as their own, and... this jab these two suits here, and then... Another one that was not. I think we got a bad batch. A lot, a lot of booze. Maybe next time we will hopefully not get Japanese Zeus with speedruns and not plagiarize levels and no dev rats, but I guess that's a lot to ask for now a days in this game.